Good evening, Miss Bianca. Welcome on board Maharaja Express. What would you like to drink? I'll have a cosmopolitan, please. With pleasure, ma'am. Thank you so much. Well, I'm about to enjoy my favorite cocktail, and that too on a train. Well, this is the most expensive and luxurious train of India. Welcome to the Maharaja Express, where I will be staying at the Luck Presidential Suite, which is considered to be one of the world's best suites. Once occupied by the ex-president of India, Mr. Ram Nath Govind, the Amongst the many renowned personalities, the price for which comes up to buying a mega luxury car, and I am going to be bringing you this entire experience only on Wonder Lux. Ma'am, here is your ring. Thank you so much. Cheers. Let's get. Let's get. The Maharaja Express has four royal journeys and this time I am going to be exploring the heritage of India which starts from Mumbai CSMT station. Earlier you might have seen my video on the Wanderlux experience on Palace on Wheels. Now not drawing any comparisons but I have been told that the Maharaja Express is India's number one and most expensive train along with being the world's leading luxury train. Now I'm very excited to find out what's new in store for me this time. Do you see what's happening behind me? That's what I call a royal welcome. Band, baja, dhol, shehnaiya, a red carpet and the whole staff to welcome us. Well, this is India's number one and the world's leading most luxury train, the Maharaja Express, where I will be taking you on a wanderlux journey that costs 40 lakh rupees for two people for a seven night journey. Come, pop it with So this is what a 5 star train experience looks like. Today I'm going to show you some of the stunning features of the Maharaja Express and why it's considered to be one of the most marvelous and luxurious trains in the world. While the train chugged out of Mumbai CSMT station, we enjoyed a delightful set meal on board starting with a sparkling wine followed by soup, appetizer, main course and dessert with the views of the lush greens in Mumbai city gliding past me while we made our way to Udaipur. why royal luxury trains have intrigued so many affluent luxury travellers. Maybe because they're classed apart in another league itself. And that's why there are so many of them around the world, be it Japan, Europe, England and the likes. And I'm proud to say that India too makes it a part of this list mainly for its history, hospitality and culturally rich destinations that have captured the fancy of many, making it so popular amongst foreign tourists to pick India's Maharaja Express. Now this royal wagon touches base to some of Rajasthan's top cities, be it Udaipur, Jodhpur, Bikaner, Rantambur, Fatehpur, Sikri, Agra, Delhi. While I will be deboarding in Jaipur because I have yet another exciting Wanderlux journey to showcase to you guys. Now before I take you on a tour of my presidential suite, let me give you some important facts about the Maharaja Express. The word Maharaja itself evokes grandiose images of the bygone era. The train reflects the journey of the Indian royalty and British aristocracy in the luxury of their private saloons with guests being tended by their private butlers. Speaking of the coaches, there are a total of 23 coaches and each guest coach has been named after the Indianized names of precious and semi-precious jewels like Pitonia, Pukraj, Beiroz, Gomed and many more. There are a total of four categories of rooms and the Maharaja Express is the only Indian train with four categories of rooms starting with deluxe cabins, junior suites, the suite and then comes the presidential suite. Are you ready to check it out? Let's go. Namaste Madam, Maharaja Express ke Presidential Suite mein aapka hai. Thank you so much. Welcome to my Presidential Suite. I can't begin to tell you how exquisite this suite is. It occupies one full coach of a train. It's like a two bedroom mini apartment. It's 448 square feet. It has a living room and two bedrooms. The master bedroom comes with a double bed, an in suite bathroom with a bathtub and a shower stall. And all the toiletries used in each of the guest rooms on the train are from Forest Essentials. 
the borders around the starry ceiling also that you see is all hand painted now the second bedroom has two twin beds and an end suite bathroom with a separate shower stall and coming down to the living room it has a sofa seating along with a study table touching a mini bar with some refreshments magazines and newspapers now the other amenities on the train include a direct dialing telephone and also has television and OTT subscription in each guest coach so you can surf on Netflix, Hotstar, whatever you like. So the costing for this comes up to approximately 40 lakh rupees excluding taxes which is about 20 lakh rupees per person for a 7 days journey. Now if this isn't royalty then what is? You know I truly feel a very majestic and a royal vibe from this entire presidential suite and uh, the guests too have been some renowned personalities like our ex-president of India Mr. Ramnath Kovind, Mrs. Cherry Blair, Sir Trevor McDonald, some famous Hollywood celebrities have all been a part of this train. Yeah, RK, one uh, black coffee, please. Yes, thank you. And how can I forget the 24-7 private butler service that is assigned to every guest on the train. All I have to do is dial a respective number where the private butler will be assigned to me or I can even call them on their personal number to tend to anything I ask for. So coming down to the other facilities of the Express, there are two very elegant lounge bars. The first one is the Raja Club and the second is the Safari Lounge along with two in-house dining restaurants. The Mayur Mahal which depicts a peacock themed restaurant and second is the Rang Mahal which reflects the colours of the palace and they're absolutely divine. Now I have to base some emphasis on the interiors that make it super luxe. The Mayur Mahal as you can see is like a side right from a royal dining imagery. The wooden work that is used here is pure monogamy. The grey tiles are individual chips that have come from Spain and all the table glasses are from France. And this too is a hand woven Kashmiri carpet. These water glasses are from Squad Whistle, Germany and these chairs too are handmade by Kashmiri carpenters. And the rung mahal that you see is also divine in its own character. The carpet-like ceiling that you see is actually a handmade painting with the use of pure Jaipuri colours. The wooden work used here is all pure Burmese teak. And that's not it, you have to pay some attention to the crockery and cutlery that is specially customised for the Maharaja Express. Now these plates alone are 18 karat gold plates from Paris. Now the shine might have reduced a little bit but I must say it looks super premium and luxe. I better not break this one. And if there's one thing that truly impressed me on the train was the stellar fine dining available from a host of cuisines that are delectably served as part of the set meal menu. And the chef makes sure that all your needs are met. Even if you wish to savour something out of the menu, Chef John made sure that even that is possible. While the meals are delicious, you can even enjoy the best of liquor and premium wines that is served on an unlimited basis 24-7 that is included in your package. While the guests are on the train, they can relax in the lounge, surf on Netflix or bond with the other guests by playing various board games available on the train. So these are some of the perks of travelling in an ultra luxury train. There is 24-7 butler service, fabulous wine and dine and luxurious accommodation. Now I can fairly say that the Maharaja Express is catering to the affluent foreign traveller who wants to immerse himself in the richness of India. There are Americans, English, Japanese, Russians and travellers from across the world who have travelled by the Maharaja Express. Because for them, it's mainly shelling a couple of thousand US dollars, which then goes up to 50,000 US dollars, which is approximately 40 lakh Indian rupees for a presidential suite experience. And that is why Maharaja Express is India's youngest, most luxurious and expensive train. Touch down in Jodhpur and all set and ready to explore this beautiful city. Well, one of the perks of staying at the presidential suite and the suite is that you get your own personal car, driver and a guide to take you around in the city while the other travellers will be escorted in a Volvo bus. 
Coming down to the main highlight of the train is the amazing itineraries to explore each destination where the guests get the full essence of the city. Right from exploring the history of the 18th century Mehrangar Fort along with the first class services provided by the train staff is outstanding. There are lady helpers, train managers and a doctor present at all times on the destination if the guest requires any help. We then headed to capture the hustle and bustle of the old Sardar Bazaar market and the evening in Jodhpur ended with a wholesome feast at the Khas Bagh, a heritage boutique hotel in Jodhpur for some drinks and dinner. And our next stop was to chug down in Bikaner, where we visited the historic Junagar Fort. All the structures in the Ambar Fort represent opulence and architectural genius. And this is the glorious history of India we truly admire. Now coming down to my favourite part of the day is the sunset on the sand dunes of Bikaner. The whole vibe and setup is amazing, with the sun setting on the dunes and the guests seated in front of the cultural show organised for us with singers and dancers showing off their expertise. Apart from the delicious food, the free flowing bar was just what we needed on a chilly night. Well, back to the train after that wonderful, wonderful day spent in Bikaner. I must say that the itineraries and excursions that is planned by the Maharaja Express is as good as a first-class experience on board as well. Right from the staycation, the hospitality, the dining, the over-courteous staff that is ready to provide you anything at a beck and call is absolutely mind-blowing. And something that the foreign tourists coming on board find absolutely exquisite. I too had a wonderful time shooting this video only for you guys and I hope you liked watching it as well. Do let me know your comments in the video. I will be back with many, many more Lux experiences only for you guys. Until then, this is your girl Bianca Saurashri. I will see you soon. Good night.